with the other two. So it is Montoya leading from Michael Schumacher as we go on to the third lap. But Michael Schumacher now having an attack around the outside. Montoya locked up side by side. This in reminds me of Coulthard. Raikkonen now coming into it. Raikkonen up into second place. Fantastic move from the Finn. And he's trying to fend off Schumacher. Schumacher comes back and retakes second. Well, well, good opportunistic driving from Kimi Raikkonen. He saw Montoya's error. He saw Michael trying to go around the wrong side. He went on the inside, but he had to concede coming into the Nürburgring chicane because Michael was on a mission he was not going to lift off and Raikkonen and thought oops this time I'll be prudent oh this is great racing between three different manufacturers we've got Montoya in the Williams this I think he's still running okay hasn't gone off but Alex Jung lost a fair bit of time thanks to that so he's dropped well behind that battle between De La Rosa and Sato as a result looking back from Michael Schumacher's car at the McLaren of Kimi Raikkonen Raikkonen in the third place after his best qualifying performance to date and the Finn who's taken over the role of Mika Hakkinen effectively at McLaren really showing his true colours once again he is a good racer and we saw him almost take second place from Michael Schumacher well that would have been a story if he'd actually managed to hold on to it but sensibly perhaps he didn't take not far behind and Ralph's managed to split Felipe Massa from David Coulthard so Montoya gets through an advantage from Montoya going into Grand Curb, he's got clear air, whereas Raikkonen, watch for Michael Schumacher trying to get benefit, Raikkonen loses it big time behind McNish, picks up the slipstream, but watch Michael Schumacher come and prepare to swoop past both of them, under breaking into Adelaide happen. Well, Raikkonen took advantage earlier on, and this time it's Michael Schumacher trying to squeeze down the inside, outside he always nearly lost it, Schumacher gets it back together, great car control, and holds on to the position. And Ralph Schumacher also sort of watching the fun and games ahead of him, and I think he lost, so he did one of us, here he comes, Michael Schumacher, comes across start finish line, Kimi Raikkonen in the pit lane, I think Schumacher's just, just going to sneak it as they come around Esteril, oh, oh this so is close. so close, Kimi Michael's, Raikkonen, he's got the momentum, but Raikkonen done a brilliant job, fantastic from Kimi Raikkonen, now he's got to fend off the Ferrari, can he do it? This is a pressure point, coming down to the braking area at the hairpin. Tyres that have just been fitted onto the car, they are preheated, but Michael Schumacher looking for the advantage. Can he dive back on the inside? No. That was beautifully driven by the Finn. I'll tell you what, you couldn't get closer than that. Kimi Raikkonen had one. Oh, and Michael looks to go down the inside into the Nürburgring chicane. No way there, Michael. And also, the ice cool Finn is not about to give you an opportunity. He needs these first few, or the first half of the lap, just to get a feel for the